Paul the Punisher Williams, will you step up please, Paul, and say hello to the great, great people. And I'd like to say, um, first of all, I'd thanks to God, you know what I'm saying, for allowing me to come out here and perform for y'all ladies and gentlemen, and boys and girls. But, um, you know, Winky, man, you know, he, he may be um, more aggressive than me, and once again, you know, he put some little punches to me and stuff, but I'll be turning, you know, even though I, I feel like, you know what I'm saying, I'm using my jab pretty good. You know, this is jab and stuff, you know. When I seen him, you know what I'm saying, like slowing down, I started getting stronger and stronger. But he was getting, he was going to the body and stuff. But, you know, I, I, was, I was the hard work that um, we put out there, you know, DC and stuff, you know what I'm saying, training that we went through for them four months, you know, it was just me preparing to go out there and fight it all. You know, I did all the training, you know. I was going to have to take help that man, because he, he, he took some big shots and he took some big shots. You know, he wasn't going nowhere, you know. Of course, we both liked the knockout, you know, but, you know, he wasn't going nowhere, I wasn't going nowhere. I was trying to get out of my work from either way. It went, we went six rounds, one round, or 12 rounds out of my work through the whole fight. That's my game plan, you know what I'm saying? It's just keep out working. What we do is stop doing. And that's what we got to do. That's what we do. Thank you. 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 Our champion. <laughs> First of all, I want to definitely give it up to Paul and support a great fight. You know what I mean? Uh, I knew he was going to do a lot of punches, but I knew he was going to do that. But uh, like I said, I can't take nothing away from him. Man, he came up with it. You know, I, I felt good. Uh, you know, he was just so long, man. <laughs> Thinking that he was known, but you know he was long. <laughs> but uh, I can't take nothing away from him. I'm glad, you know, from the type fight I come and fight anybody. Um, you know, no matter what. You know, Paul is a fighter that a lot of people didn't want to fight. Now I can tell you why now. You can throw a million punches, you got a long arm and he's a tough fighter, small fighter. You know, it's tough. I hit him with some good body shots, some good hooks, and so he came back and, and did his thing. So I definitely think that I think that. You know what I mean? I, I, Really, uh, I'm happy with my performance. I, I, I know my time was low, but you know, I fought a good, a great fight that, that that made it all. You know what I mean? So, you know, this is the first press conference that I ever came to when I lost, but I, I felt that I had to come in and give it to you uh, like you deserve. You know? so, I definitely want to say this is definitely not it, you know what I mean, it was 21, 21 months off, uh, no excuse to you for the great fight. Now it's time, you know, to get back into the ring, uh, you know, fight a little more often, get, get one or two more fights in, you know, then we're going to see what we're going to do Like I said, uh, I take my hat off to him for the great fight, and uh, you know, I'm happy for him, and you need to go on it, and, and, and get what you deserve, and get some of these good ways to get some of these fights that won't fight you. that you did not want to retire. You thought you had a couple of more fights left in you. Um, it's a matter of being more active. Oh, definitely. You know, like I said, when Jordan left and came back, he didn't score 50 points when he first came back. You know what I mean? So, you know, but I took the best fight out there to fight my yes. first fight coming back. I didn't, I didn't take a bum like the rest of them. So, you know, I just showed my heart and my will to fight the best. And like I said, you know, I came up short tonight. That's okay. You know, that's what boxing is. You win some losing. Middleweight, the place for you? Oh, definitely. Middleweight, the place for me. Uh, like I said, just he was just a little, he was just a little sharper than I did. Mean, he got off and did what he had to do. I had an opportunity to uh, speak with your uh, trainer, Mr. Peterson, before the fight. And he told me you were going to be busy, you're going to be all action. I had no idea, man. Another fight of a thousand punches. Where do you get that from? Man, it's, it's through the hard training, you know what I'm saying? And we, we, if you look at the, on the ring of life, how the, the hard work I put in, you know what I'm saying? I put in a whole lot of work, you know. And when we get, he, he was game stuff, you know. Through the rounds, you know what I'm saying? I think the fifth round, I hurt my thumb in the fifth round, you know what I'm saying? Put through his gloves, kind of like busted open and stuff. But other than that, you know, 
you know, it kind of slowed me down, kind of feeling numb, so I had to, you know what I'm saying, get in my rhythm again, you know what I'm saying, and just keep, you know, so occupied, but, you know, once I started getting off and started getting relaxed, you know what I'm saying, then the pain went away, you know what I'm saying, I, I, I start, uh, sometimes I come out and throw big explosive combinations on them, you know what I'm saying, and get, you know what I'm saying, just outwork them. Paul, once again, it's, it's, a, it's an honor to be at your fight. We thank you so much for giving us a little time. We look forward to seeing you again. Oh, thank you.